I'm Dr. Devin Atria, I'm a vet here at Siler Animal Hospital. We took Kane in this morning. He was found, I believe, up north. Um, no, he was in the Everglades. In the Everglades, but I thought it was up north by Okeechobee in the northern region. Um, he came in in very poor condition, extremely thin. You can see every one of his ribs. He was missing large patches of hair, very red, covered with demodex mites on his skin. He also had ear mites um, in his ears. We cleaned out his ears. Uh, we've given him a couple good meals already, and he's eaten a bunch. He was dehydrated, um, sunburnt on his back, and just infected ears from scratching um, scratching at those mites. He did have intestinal parasites, but his heartworm was negative, his tick titers were and negative. Start getting the demodex under control. Um, we're gonna start treating him as soon as he gets a little more stable here since he is so thin and emaciated. We wanna stabilize and put some meat on him, but probably next week we'll start uh, taking care of the demodex mites. Yeah, so it's gonna be some time yet it's before be we can time. even get him out there. He needs to gain all the weight, yeah. get rid of the demodex, and he does have parasites, so we need all the donations and help we can get right now. Maybe down the road we can get a good foster. He would be good for him to be oh, He's a super sweet dog. He's just got a great personality. After all he went through, he was um, just very warm, very loving. He should be able to make a full recovery and be a, a great pet. Uh, this is Kane. He was brought into our rescue today. He's the latest in the abandonment and neglect epidemic in South Florida. A good Samaritan who is his angel, who we thank from the bottom of our hearts, found him as he was driving through the Everglades. Steve, and thank Becky, and through Becky's help. Awesome. Steve and Becky, we thank you, and Kane thanks you. Um, they took him in, got him food, got him water, bathed him, got the fleas and ticks off him. He's the spirit of a champ. We've learned that he loves his ball. His tail's been wagging, he's been kissing since he's known he was safe. Very gentle spirit, loves people, doesn't guard his food, doesn't guard his ball. We're going to do everything we can to get him his medical attention and give him love and heal his soul and his spirit, but we need your help. We ask that you not only donate to the You Caring Fund for his medical attention, we beg of you to make a monthly recurring donation. If all of our followers did a reoccurring monthly donation of $5, we would never have to turn these dogs away. We need to have the funds. Every penny goes to their medical care. Nobody takes a salary. It goes to nothing but caring for these dogs. We thank you. So we appreciate anybody's help that we can and please give to Everglades Abandoned Dog Rescue. Thanks.